This video is on the structural classes of hormones. There are three structural classes of hormones. These are your steroid hormones, protein hormones, and amine hormones. It is important to know the structural class of your hormones since the properties as well as how these hormones behave depend on their structure. Your steroid hormones are based from cholesterol. They are synthesized as needed and not stored. They are lipid soluble but water insoluble. Therefore, they require carriers, such as proteins, for them to be transported in blood. Examples include cortisol, aldosterone, testosterone, estrogen, and progesterone. Protein hormones are, of course, made from proteins, as well as peptides. They are synthesized, then stored in the cell as secretory granules until needed. They are water-soluble, therefore, they do not need proteins as their carriers. Examples include FSH, LH, TSH, HCG, glucagon, parathyroid hormone, growth hormone, and prolactin. Now, under your protein hormones, there is a subset of hormones which you call as your glycoprotein hormones. These are composed of two polypeptide chains containing carbohydrates. Now, these two polypeptide chains are your alpha chains and your beta chain. The alpha chain among all glycoprotein hormones would be the same whereas the beta chain would be unique. That is why the beta chain determines specificity. It is important to know this since HCG, which is one of your glycoprotein hormones, is detected in pregnancy kits or pregnancy tests. The part of your HCG which is detected in your preg kits would be the beta chain, not the alpha chain, since the beta chain is the one which determines specificity. The last Structured class of hormones would be your amine hormones. Amine hormones are derived from the amino acid tyrosine. They are synthesized and stored in the cell as secretory granules as ne until needed. Some require a carrier protein, while others do not. Examples include your catecholamines, which include epinephrine and norepinephrine, as well as your thyroid hormones, tyroxine and triiodotyronine, or T3. These are all derived from the amino acid tyrosine.